What's going on everybody? Stabs here. Welcome back uh, to another one of my videos. Now what you guys are actually be watching today is going to be a another 100 plus kill gameplay. I know I haven't actually uploaded one of these in a while and the main reason for that is just because I haven't really gone for them. You guys know that um, it's been a while since I've actually been playing Call of Duty you know, seriously and for hours and hours on end every day. Um, that kind of started to come back ever since my um, my school year ended so you guys know I finished like um, almost a week in like three four days it'll be a week but um, basically what I did with this was just run around like a crazy person you guys are gonna see um, I'll explain it later in the end uh, why it cuts off early but basically what I did with this um, towards the beginning of the gameplay I don't know what it is with me but for some reason I start off really 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 slow um, in certain games, especially when I'm playing games like this, and uh, that's just the fact that the other team was mostly playing a little bit slow. So basically, what I did was um, I was just trying to stay in one spot. Honestly, I was just holding down positions and stuff like that. So um, I did cut out. Um, I think like the final game was about uh, I think 12 minutes long, and this one I got to about six minutes and 30 seconds or something like that. So, uh, you guys are going to see, I cut down a big chunk of time and a lot of useless stuff that I definitely didn't need. But, um, yeah, like I was saying, I did cut out a bunch of uh, useless kills or deaths and stuff like that. Um, you guys are going to notice, a lot of my streaks actually do get me my kills. So, uh, pay attention to that. You guys can see that I'm actually running servers, rape, and raps. You guys know for a fact, those are my uh, go-to streaks. Now, you guys can actually see I'm using the VMP with my regular class setup which it should be long barrel quick draw grip and extended mags i run extended mags just because um it does make it really really easy to spray like five maybe six people if you are accurate and uh get all those kills now this next part you're actually gonna see me get um basically destroyed from the back in that garage as you guys just saw and this literally scared the crap out of me while i was playing because i don't know if you guys ever been um hit by one of those things or basically killed um those things make a very very loud like shanking noise when they kill you and it basically just scares the crap out of me every time i get killed by one but when you're actually using it, it's pretty really cool um, it's one of the things I actually want to get from the black market, but uh, you guys actually see that I am using the gravity spikes in in this video Now uh, the reason I was if you guys don't know this for any new subscribers. I began a lot of you guys So thank you um, for those new subscribers. I'm actually going for the hero armor I know it is a little late, but um, basically what I'm trying to do is go for the hero armor So yesterday um, after this game, I think I actually finished this so um, right now I am on Seraph I believe I think I'm just jumping around and stuff like that um, but I do already have the psychosis dude done. I can't, I really, I, I'm so bad with names, but, um, you guys can see that. So I did finish this yesterday. If you guys want me to, to basically start uploading videos of me getting the challenges done and stuff like that, let me know. Um, I feel like it would be pretty fun for you guys to actually see, um, what goes on when you actually do complete it if you haven't already. So just let me know. In the next clip of this video, you guys are actually going to see, um, the perfect example of why I actually do use extended mags. On the VMP, so you guys are gonna see. Um, I actually think I get like a four piece, maybe even five piece. I think I got a little lucky with the fifth one, and uh, this is literally the perfect example on why I do use the extended mags attachments on the VMP. Uh, just because um, the VMP does do a lot of damage, you guys don't use it, and uh, it's extremely accurate. Sometimes it does have like jitters and stuff like that, which is pretty weird, but um, other than that, it is a very, very good gun. Uh, in a little bit in the game, you guys can see, I actually do bring up the scoreboard. And you guys can see, right now, I am actually at the 80 kill mark. Now, uh, this is the point in the gameplay where I actually do start taking a little bit easy. Because um, once I see that I'm doing really, really good, I want to try and do my best to get to the 100 kills. And um, you guys can see the... Um, the scoreboard is not even past the 200 market, so if you guys don't know, a hard point actually goes to 250 points for whatever team gets it first. And uh, games like that can take a very, very long time if two pl uh, teams play it perfectly. They can go to 249 and then the other team can win 250. So it is a pretty, pretty long game, especially for a lot of uh, 100 plus kill gameplay. I think I've gotten most of mine in here or in Domination. Those are the two longest ones. Um, but like I was saying, I do usually start to take it a little bit easier um, this 
late into the game because I can tell that I'm going to get the 100 plus kills. Uh, sometimes even if I want to drop like 110 or 115, I do still try. But uh, in this point of the game, I usually do only try and get my streaks to kind of guarantee it. So I do play a little bit more passive, a little bit slow. Uh, try not to rush around too much. And uh, once I do get the streaks, it's basically a lock and I know that I'm going to get the 100 kills. Uh, just a quick tip for you guys that do want to try and drop 100 plus kills. It is not really that hard in my opinion, um, but I do get them a lot, so I can't really say that for everybody else. Um, just kind of depends on your play style, but the thing I do on Newtown the most is right when you spawn, check mid-map. If they're not there, go straight to their spawn, just because it is extremely easy to spawn kill somebody on this map. And um, usually when one of those spawn, there's always like one or two, maybe even three sometimes, um, spawning in another corner, maybe another side of their spawn. So just be weary of that. I always check the spawn completely before you rush into a little corner. I know I always do that, and then I get bad luck. And they always spawn in the back garden and uh, as I'm running into the house. So I always end up dying. But then other than that, um, you can always get like the whole team spawning at the same time, which is really annoying. But uh, there's not really much you can do about that. Alright, so as you guys can see, the game is actually coming to an end. There's about like 30 seconds left uh, in the actual video. So, um, you guys are going to notice at the end, um, for some reason, theater doesn't record like past like 12 minutes and 50 seconds. This game was obviously longer. So, you guys are going to see that. So, literally, with my luck, right when I got to 100, the gameplay stopped. So, it was like 249 or 245 um, time in the game. And uh, you guys are going to see, I literally just got to 100 and I showed the scoreboard. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. I did finish with like 105 or 106 kills total. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, remember to subscribe, follow social media links down in the description below. I will see you guys next time. Peace out. I'm going to let the rest of the gameplay play out.